Walk 5 is a lovely combination of wooded valley, moorland and spectacular coast scenery. The planned start of the walk in the valley was Hunter's Inn, but road closures forced us to start further to the west. We took the wooded valley path to Ladies Mile, crossed Trenty's Hoe down to the glass box, took the coast path to Peter Rock, walked up Head and Mouth Cleave to Hunter's Inn and back to our start. We start downhill towards Hunter's Inn to join the path below us. This path is a lovely wooded trail filled with birdsong and the sound of the running stream. After a couple of kilometres we climb up out of the valley to Ladies Mile and follow it round the south of Trentis Hoe Down. An easy section of walk which the sheep ahead of us seem to like too. This is the track up onto the down. Another hard climb. Rewarded by views across the downs. Prentice Hoe Down Nearly at the top and the coast path ahead. This is where we've come from. And this is where we're going. The gorse is splendid. The rugged coast behind and ahead of us. A recent landslip. Downhill towards East Cleave. And we can see almost to Ilfracoon behind. The final section to Hedden's Mouth. Our lunch stop with a fine view up Hedden's Mouth Cleave. We walk along the cleave and get sight of Hedden's Mouth Beach behind. It's scree-like on this descent, but easy going once we're down. Time for a drink at Hunter's Inn. But it's closed too for the way it works. So we have to make do with some water and head back to our start point. 